What were you living for? What are you talking about? Up on the mountain. What kept you going? Yucatan oil. Who? Who were you doing it for? Me. Who else? You. Guess again and don't say Jed. I know what you're driving at. Then you don't need to ask me why I did what I did. Yes, I do. You tell me. Look, it was Holly. You did it all for her. Then it was for nothing. Really? You're walking. Again. That's your idea of nothing? Because your dream to walk back into Holly's life is what kept you going. Every agonizing step, each little effort, the tremendous progress you made, it was all for her. Then it was for a lie, your lie, Natalie. Look, what if I had told you the truth? What if I had come to you one day and I would have said, Luke, the woman you're in love with, the woman you are going through this incredible hell for to go back to, she's married now to your best friend. Would that have inspired you to keep walking? Listen to me. You listen to me. You wanted to walk back to Holly. You kept thinking about the future you were going to have together with her. You lived for that future. Was I supposed to take that away from you? Look, you have no idea how difficult it was for me either. I knew the truth about Holly and I had to conceal it from you. I heard you every day talking about the wonderful plans of coming back to Port Charles. And I knew that someday I was going to have to tell you. You never really got around to that, I did you? I was going to do it. You were going to? Natalie, how trite! I was going to do it the very day you came back here, Luke. Well, I couldn't wait that long. Well, you should have given us some advance notice. Well, you should have given me a little notice. You should have told me this a long time up before. Jed and I almost did. Several times. Luke. Luke. I spent... I can't tell you how many sleepless nights... thinking about, do I tell him, don't I tell him, whether I should, whether I shouldn't, and how. And then I would see you working during the day. And making all that incredible improvement. Was I supposed to take that away from you? Because what... What you accomplished, what you accomplished... was nothing short of a miracle. And I couldn't take that away from you. I couldn't do that to you, and I couldn't do that to me. Can't you see that? Yeah, I can see that. I can see that in a... Natalie, let go of my arm. Let go of my arm. Quit bouncing the game. Baby, I saw it, but it still don't mean a damn. 